guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Sierra and today I'm going to vlog. I'm taking myself out on a little date, you know. It's not really a date. I'm just going thrifting and then I'm gonna go to lunch. Okay guys, but yeah, I just parked and you guys can probably see me a lot better, but Today, I'm gonna be shopping and taking myself out to lunch because I feel like it. And yeah, um, this is a necklace. You're not supposed to buy evil eye jewelry for yourself. This was gifted to me by my boyfriend. And then my shirt's from Brandy Melville. And then my shorts are from Zara, but I probably can't show those to you because, I mean, I'm sitting down. This strip is basically just a bunch of really eclectic resale shops and thrift shops and cute little cafes and it's kind of like a pocket of California, but in Houston, and it's just super cute. And let's get out of here. So this is just what it looks like. It's really cute. I mean, the streets are not cute, but this is cute. Here we go. I really just wanted to come to this place. It's called Petty Cash, and it's kind of just like a resale shop. So let's go in here. I'm going to pay right now to see what they have to offer me. This is like what my outfit looks like. Can y'all see me like a little bit at least? At this point, y'all, I was getting super fed up with this whole thrifting process. I don't really go thrifting often just because I don't have patience. And I was getting super annoyed not finding anything. Now I'm at this cafe. It's really cute. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. They have the best cookies. Um, they're like huge and they're delicious. That's really all I want. And I'm probably gonna go get something to eat later sorry if i'm not the best at vlogging i kind of forget to pull out my camera but i'm gonna try to do my best for you guys like I said. and this is a cute little bakery and they have like coffee and stuff Look at that. I'm now at local foods and I really wanted a lox bagel. So I got a lox bagel. I don't know why she was screaming to not the place. The weather is so nice, so I just have to take advantage. I'm sitting outside. I'm honestly scared being here right now because I feel like I feel like people have corona and they're still going out. So I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like out here. this really big table because it has an umbrella and when the sun came out I didn't want to be hot. You snooze you lose, am I right? I barely had an appetite but I'm finally getting my appetite back. So I feel really good about that. After this I think I'm gonna go to the Dollar Real and then what? I'll attempt to thrift with one of my friends in a little bit. So let's just wait on that. Come here necklace. The cookie wasn't even good today so I'm really upset. And then the cashier started flirting with me and I was like no. How you gonna put when we're gonna have a mask? First of all, this coffee isn't even that good either. The guy gave me the cookie for free, so I guess I was looking that cute. I can get a free cookie. Okay. Yummy, yummy, yummy. This is a salmon bagel, a lox bagel. It has cream cheese, onion jam, and it's delicious. And it comes on everything bagel. And then I got this chicken pozole. It's super good. I love. This is the only place I know that has lox bagels, but I'm obsessed. This was this meal was literally $17 and I tipped them. But I feel like if you're working during a pandemic, you deserve a tip. But this was ridiculously expensive. I only eat here every once in a while. But if you have a local food in your area, you should definitely try it. What's 
talking about. What is this? Is this like some sort of mom baggy swim? This is baggy. Okay, I don't like whatever. Whatever this is. I guess they don't have wings in it. Here's a peek at the outfit. I'm honestly getting very frustrated because I just want to find jeans and I can't find jeans that I like. Guys, I'm at the mall. I have not found like I'm on my way to Nordstrom because I desperately have to go to the bathroom. But people keep a lot of me and yelling at me. And it's just not fun. Wait a second, it's called Kylie's skin at Nordstrom. It's since when? I turned the sound off because I didn't want copyright, but I really like this dress. I didn't buy it because I felt like my butt would be falling out of it, but yeah, super cute. I just had to pass. There was really nothing that I saw that I liked and I was so disappointed. This dress was super cute, 10 out of 10. I see this for like a steak dinner, but where am I going during a pandemic? Their body makes so sad. Um, I have a fashion from interesting. Love style, velvet petals. I'm gonna smell all of these. Really good. It kind of smells like fresh and clean, but like good. I think I actually wanna get this. And I think I'm gonna get. I think I'm gonna get the lotion as well, but I don't know. I don't have any lotion that smells like this. So I think I might just have to pick this up. Oh. The cute at the back. I'll be doing a little Molly haul when I get home but that's what i got from me today guys so it is night time and i know i didn't vlog oh my gosh are y'all close say no say no right now <sighs> okay so i kind of like forgot to vlog for a little bit and also my phone only has seven percent but right now i'm working i do uber eats for my money and it do be paying very well i want to get boba but they're closed i'm so hurt i'm literally five minutes late to boba so now what? There's no other good bubble places. I'm gonna uh, talk to y'all when I get home and show you everything that I bought. Got home and yeah. Hey! Hey guys, so now I'm gonna do a haul on everything that I got. I'm gonna start off with what I got from the thrift. First from the thrift, I just got one thing. I just got this really big t-shirt that is from a cruise and just a cruise of Italy. And I feel like this would be really cute for a cute little night shirt, you feel me? So you always want a really nice big night shirt, and this was like two bucks, an Italian cruise t-shirt. So next, from TJ Maxx, if you follow me on TikTok, you know I'm obsessed with TJ Maxx. I'm always going because I love a good deal. First, I got this bubble bath. I love Tree Hut. The brand is amazing. I have their shave oil, their body butters, and their body scrubs, and they're great. So I wanted to get this because I've never seen it before. It's this Sun Kiss Sands bubble bath, and it was only $3.99, and you just kind of dump it in your bath, get a nice little bubble action going. And this has white clay to cleanse and smooth skin. It just smells like soap. It doesn't really have a certain fragrance like fruity or vanilla. It just smells like soap. Next, I got this pack of fuzzy socks. I have an entire foot care routine and part of that foot care routine is to put on fuzzy socks at the end to lock in all the moisture of whatever I put on my feet. And these were only $5 for three of them. Next I got this bra from TJ Maxx, this is just a Calvin Klein and it's one of those lounge bras. I hated the lighting so I'm just going to film on my back camera but let's get into Victoria's Secret. Alright y'all so let's get into what I got. So I bought a lot of things in sets and I took recommendations of what y'all told me to try out because I've never gotten Victoria's Secret fragrances before. But y'all know I love my vanilla scent, so I decided to pick out the infamous Fair Vanilla. This smells bomb, you guys. Thank you so much. And I also got the matching lotion because you always smell better when you layer your scents. Next, I got Bali Coconut Palm. This one is more for summer and spring. It does smell like the coconut nectar and fresh pineapple. It smells very pina colada. Esque, but it smells really cute the packaging is cute and everything was like $5.99 y'all it was three for 25 and then some things were $5.99 each so there's that this one I just picked up on my own no one recommended this but I'm gonna recommend it to y'all it smells really good if you like those tropical scents you should definitely try this out next I got this I've also never heard of this either but it smells so fresh and clean this is Santorini Neroli water 
and I got the body mist as well as the lotion. They both smell great. They smell very fresh and clean, kind of like laundry detergent and you can't go wrong with just having a really nice clean scent. So I wanted to get that set as well. This one was recommended to me. This is Velvet Petals from Victoria's Secret. I've never tried this before. I was expecting for this to give very old lady grandma, but this smells amazing. I love this. And it says almond glaze, lush blooms, da 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 da. And it smells very nice. It smells like flowers and just creamy goodness. Yeah, I got Pure Seduction. I got the shimmer one just because I thought it would be fun. And this also smells very nice. It kind of smells like bubble gum. I don't think it really smells like flowers so much, but this smells really cute. I feel like this is a better night fragrance than daytime. But yeah, thank y'all for recommending this one to me as well. That's what I got from Victoria's Secret, you guys. I got three sets. This I already know is about to be my jam, my go-to. So thank you very much for putting me on, you guys. And y'all also put me on to these two right here. Thank you, thank you, thank you. They smell bomb. But yeah, y'all should definitely go pick up these scents as well because I've never heard of them before and they smell super good. Hygiene stuff that I got over the week. This is from Target and H-E-B. So let's get right into it. First, I got Dove Sensitive Skin Bars. They're unscented and all that good stuff, not drying. So yeah, I got a six pack of these because I run out of these like every week. Next, I got this body scrub from Triha. I'm obsessed with Triha scrubs. This is the Tahitian Vanilla Bean one. I love their body butter. I use it on my feet at night. And I've never seen this before, but I had to go cop this OGX body wash in Shea Soft and Smooth. This is so bomb. I think it's my new favorite body wash. I love OGX coffee, but this one right here is something different. This smells like butterscotch candy, just creamy butterscotch, and I'm obsessed. I personally really like baby lotion, so I've been buying that a lot more now. I really use baby lotion every night, and I haven't seen this one before. This is the vanilla oat, and y'all know I love my vanilla scents, so I have to cop this. Next, I got this TheraBreath. Um, I've been hearing really good things about it and I tried it tonight. Like I said, I got this stuff over the week. I got this like three days ago, but it tastes so nasty. Like this tastes like water that someone spit out when they were done brushing their teeth. Very disgusting, but I heard that this gets rid of the bacteria that prevents morning breath. So we'll see if my breath is kicking in the morning or not. Lastly, I got two body butters from Triha. I got the Coco Colada and then I got Marula and Jasmine and they both smell great. I haven't used these yet. If you have sensitive skin, I wouldn't recommend that you use these on your body. I have sensitive skin and these kind of make my eczema act up. So I mainly use these for my feet. But yeah, guys, that's it for this mini hygiene haul. I'm gonna try to get better at vlogging. I just, I just normally don't vlog, so it wasn't constantly on my mind to be recording. So sorry if this wasn't like the best vlog. Be sure to let me know in the comments if you want more of these or just any other videos that you want to see from me. And be sure to give it a thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.